Hey everyone, Blauk Yakov here, and today we're going to be setting up our Razer headphones, keyboard, and mouse to Lumia Stream, and we'll show you how. Razer has an absolutely wide range of products, from monitors and mice to mats to keyboards, headsets, and everything in between. Razer has it all. So to set up all of their RGB products with Lumia Stream, so you can tie it to Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, and soon to even come TikTok, will be a dream come true, wouldn't it? Well, do we have a tutorial for you? So to begin, let's make sure we download Lumia Stream. So go to LumiaStream.com, go to get Lumia Stream free and free for Windows. This will work for both the free and premium version of Lumia Stream. So no worries there. Just download that and set that up. Next up, go to Razer.com and look for Synapse. So you want to install the Synapse software, download that and install it. After you install that, make sure you have all of your devices connected to Razer Synapse. Make sure you have, if you have a Razer key light, make sure that's connected, headphones, you know, mouse, all the Razer products you have, make sure it's set up in Synapse first. After that's done, you'll open up Lumia Stream and you'll set that up and you'll go to connections and you'll go to add new connection and you'll just type in Razer. So I'll press connect. And now here's where you select your devices. We don't have a way to filter out the different devices you may have. So if you have, you know, two mice connected to your computer, both of them will change. And if you have two headsets, so on and so forth. If you have a Razer key light, just make sure you press Chroma link. Or if you have another device that either doesn't fit in these categories, or if it doesn't work, then just make sure you always connect Chroma link. It's always a safe bet to just connect Chroma link uh, because a lot of devices that don't fall into a category will fall into Chroma link. So I have a keyboard, a mouse, headset, and Chroma link set up. I'm going to press next. I'm going to press refresh. I'm going to go to my dashboard and let's just make sure it connects to Razer. So if I go to my connections, you'll see Razer is set up with the check mark. Okay. So now to quickly try this out, I'm just going to go to shortcuts right here. I'm going to go to shortcuts and I'm going to type in a color like aqua. You'll see my headphones turn aqua blue as well as my keyboard. So that's how you know it's working correctly. We'll try a few more colors, pink. I think these other lights are kind of masking, you know, what you see. So let me turn those lights off for a second. So if I turn all of the other lights off, I'll just select pink and you'll see my headphones and my keyboard turn to pink, green, blue, purple. You get the idea. So now we can set up different commands and alerts for our Razer products. So we're going to go to commands. I'm going to add a new command. And I'm just going to call this raise. And I want this just to turn to green. Press done. And I can set my duration if I want to. Let's say I only want this to you know, be set for 20 seconds. Then I want it to be set back to my default state. I'll press apply, refresh. And now if we go to our Twitch channel, I can put exclamation point raise and everything turned to green. Perfect. I could also, you know, use our Twitch extension. If you go to lumiastream.com slash extension, it'll show you how to set up the Twitch extension so you can install it and use it on your channel. And then on your channel, you know, I can just allow my viewers to just go here and trigger blue if they want to activate and then blue is triggered. It also keeps track of leaderboards to different top users and commands as well and more to come soon. Same with Twitch points. If I want to set up Twitch points, I'm going to go back to Lumia stream. I'm going to set up a Twitch point add command, and I'm just going to call this command something different. Just so you all know that it's a different command. Uh, I'm going to set up a reaction here. I'm going to set up the police reaction. I want it for 10 points for now. The duration I want to run for 12 seconds. So you can either type here or you could drag the slider. So let's see. Yeah, 13 seconds is fine. If I want to set up different chatbot commands, I can do that as well. So right here, I can say username is redeemed for points. I'm using my Razer products. You can set up TTS and so on and so forth. I can press apply, refresh. I go back to my Twitch channel. So if I click tray, I'll press redeem. And now my, you know, Razer products turn to that police reaction. From here, you can do a lot more. You can set up Twitch extensions, chat commands, Twitch points. You could even set up a chat match. Like let's say every time I want someone to say hi, anywhere in the, you know, the message, I want them to say hi. And then I want this to always run. And I want to just turn it a red color. So now if I say something like hi, wow, hi, or I say anything and then plus hi, 
you know, it'll trigger that red color. I can also create my own reactions, animations. You'll see a bunch of different things. We have videos on all of these. If I want to set up a quick reaction, just create three different slots. And I wanted to go from blue to green to let's say yellow. I test that out blue, green, yellow. I could even have it match the colors of my screen with fuse. So I can go to manage lights. Let's make sure all my razor products are in here. Press done. And now if I either go to shortcuts or I could trigger this through a chat command or alert, I can press start fuse. And now it matches that bluish color in Lumia stream. I can go over here. Let's go to a color. Let's go to a video like this where the colors are just changing. So it goes from yellow to green. And it's gone a little slow, but yeah, purple, you get the idea. So now it's reacting to the colors on my screen with fuse. You could even have react to the audio or audio plus video. So if I'm, you know, playing something here, or let's say I wanted to react to my chat microphone. So I want the color to be green and let's start fuse. So hello, hello there. How are you doing? So the louder I talk, the brighter it gets. You get the idea. And then you could do the same thing with audio plus video. You could even change the analysis method. It works a little differently. Uh, you could play around with the min and max brightness. You could play around with the sensitivity and so on and so forth. You could even have this match your heart rate sync with either Pulsoid or Hype Rate connected with Lumia Stream. And you can plug in just anything that you can think of into this to use with your Razer products. As I mentioned, check out our other videos so you get more ideas of how to use these different products and how to, you know, expand your Razer ecosystem. Razer was our first gaming peripheral integration. So, you know, there has been a long time of use with them. One last thing is that you can also hook this up with Lumia Link so that you can change your Razer devices either with an OBS or your browser or mobile app. So if I go to Lumia Stream, I'm going to press Lumia Link and either I'm going to download the apps or for now, just for demonstration purposes, I could even show you how to change it within your browser. So I'm going to go to this is my page app, but I can go to my shortcuts, which you've seen in Lumia. So I can just turn it to Aqua then my lights to turn to Aqua. And as I mentioned, this works in OBS as well. So if I come over to OBS, I'll go to docs. I'll go to custom browser docs, call this Lumia link or whatever I want, and I'll paste my URL in. I'll press apply and now Lumia link will show up there. So I can put this right here. Now the option of using the control here, I can go and just literally change my mouse and keyboard right from my OBS doc, press blue, then my razor setup changes. And it just makes it really simple and easy. This works on the mobile app as well. This works on both our free and premium versions. As I always mention, um, the Lumia link is, you know, available. We're updating it. We want to hear your suggestions. Uh, if you want custom images and different things like that, let us know. You could also even chat through Lumia links, but you could say whatever you want here and it'll show up in Twitch. We hope you all like this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any issues, let us know in the comments down below. And we hope you all have a luminous day.